welcome back to Tay Deco. My name is Taylor. I'm a part-time Poshmark reseller and today I'm sharing another exciting thrift haul from one of my favorite places, the Goodwill Bins. I spent a good amount of time digging through all of the treasures and I found some really cool pieces. One of the pieces is so good. It's definitely in my top favorite thrift finds of all time. And I did go to a regular Goodwill where I found about six items. So we're gonna start with those and then I'll get into the Goodwill Bins thrift haul. So grab a coffee, get cozy, and let's dive right in. Okay, the first item I got from the regular Goodwill is St. John and it's this super adorable blazer sweater jacket um very like academia vibes very well made with the buttons I only paid seven dollars and 99 cents for this so that was a steal of a deal St. John is a very expensive brand it is sold at Nordstrom um very cool I'm so excited for this the next item I got was J. Crew. It's a J. Crew blazer. This is called Super 120s. It's 100% wool, which is definitely what I'm looking for when I'm buying a J. Crew blazer because these can sell for over $100. I didn't check comps on this exact style, but I'm pretty sure I should get, be able to get a good amount. It's also in really good condition which makes me really happy. Um, I paid $6.99 for this. So again, another great deal. Um, I'm hoping that this style goes for over a hundred, but like I said, I didn't check comps yet, so we'll see. Okay, so here's an anthropology piece. This was new with tag. So this was, or this is a size two. It is the newer style anthropology because it says anthropology on the tag. It's a Kemi and Kin, it retailed for $170. So the size is a two petite, which is pretty small. I don't love picking up that size, but since it was new with tags and it was a newer style and it's a pretty substantial piece, it's just this little long sleeve dress. Um, I decided to go for it for those reasons. I did pay $8.99 for this item. So pretty good. Okay, and next I got these Patagonia pants. I paid $6.99 for these. Um, these were like just a cotton jogger pant. Uh, really good condition, very lightweight, breathable. These are the hemp, hemp cotton pant or something. You can kind of see there's like some texture to the fabric. So yeah, I feel like these will do pretty good. I mean, maybe I'll get between 30, 40. And then I got this item. This is Aline Fisher, size six, 100% linen, kind of like a blazer jacket, very lightweight. I like the color. I paid $6.99 for this item. They have this big, these big buttons in the front. I really like the brand Eileen Fisher, but I have so many things listed in my closet right now and I feel like they're just not moving. Um, when I do make a sale, it's usually a pretty good sale. So I think it just takes a little bit longer to sell, but I mean, I like picking it up just because when it does sell, it does go for a decent amount, but it just takes, it takes a little bit, so. Okay, next I have this Madewell dress, size four. I don't love picking up this brand, but it does sell, and this piece was pretty substantial, and I think it's a newer piece. I just felt like this is so cute, very in right now, this kind of style with all the buttons. Um, I paid $5.99, so that was something that I considered for sure whenever I bought this. It's 55% linen, 45% viscose, so pretty good um, fabric blend. Okay, so those are all the items that I got from a regular Goodwill. Now I'm gonna start with the Goodwill Benz haul. I am not gonna keep you guys waiting anymore. I'm gonna show you guys the item that I'm just like so excited for. So let's start with that one. Okay, so this piece, I was so excited when I saw this. So this is Ralph Lauren collection and it's the purple label which this is their most expensive label. So they have all these different labels like Lauren Ralph Lauren, Polo Ralph Lauren. There's so many different tags. This one is like their higher end label. And I found this beautiful military ja style jacket, which this retailed for over $2,000. 
it's a, it's um, a wool blend, mostly wool. There are some flaws, which I'll go over. This is a size six. It, you can see everything is in pretty decent condition. Like you can tell by these seams and the materials tag, it is 87 merino wool, 12 nylon and 1% elastane. Um, all the buttons are here. So there was, there was some flaws. So um, on this back shoulder, there's this tear on the first layer. So this is double layered. So it's not all the way through the garment, but there's definitely a hole on the first layer there. And then there's also some wear on this, yeah, on the um, elbow. Again, it's not through the whole garment, it's just through that top layer. Um, but I mean, I feel like those are pretty small flaws. Other than that, it's in great condition, definitely true to size super cute i'm so excited i was with my girlfriend at the um bins and she pulled this out and she's like do you want this she's like you don't want this do you and i was like oh my gosh yes i want that and she's like you're joking she's like stop being drama and i was like no that is such a good find so i thought that was so funny but she was just looking for things for herself and then she has a little girl that she was looking for clothes for so she's not in the reselling game or anything so yeah, she just doesn't didn't know, but I was just so excited. I also found a few other designer items that were in that same bin. So when I go through these, I'll show, I'll tell you which ones were next to that item. Okay, this was such a great find. So this is Bowden, and this is not the newest tag, but it's not the oldest tag. And this is just so stinking cute. I love the color. It's like a cobalt royal blue. Um, and then this is all embroidered. So this is just so pretty. I love all this embroidery. Um, the size is a size eight, which is great. Yeah, I just think this is a great piece. I'm so, I was so excited to find that in the bins. It's in excellent condition. Okay, so my friend found a big pile of Athleta um, pants. They were all in great condition. And she did keep like two pairs, but we found like eight total or something or six. It was crazy. So she just gave the rest to me um, after she kind of looked through and picked the ones that she wanted. But yeah, these are Athleta, the newer label. These are the Cabo linen textured wide leg pants, size 10. So these are great. This, these Cabo pants, I've sold these before um, in a different color. So they do pretty well. So pretty excited for that. Here's another Athleta, so this was with those. This is a size 12, and these are more of like a denim jeans. So these are pretty good. Again, these are in great condition. It's like somebody went to Athleta, bought themselves a bunch of jeans and pants, and then they donated them to the bins. So, wild. This also was with that Athleta. So this is a dress. This, it doesn't have the style no name, but this is a size medium very lightweight, just like an active wear dress. This is really cute. Again, this is in great condition. Okay, these are just the blue label Ralph Lauren, which is still a pretty good label. These are an extra large, 100% cotton, just like pajama pants. Um, I feel like this, the brand is good, the size is good, and then 100% cotton. I feel like people really seek that out to wear it to bed. Um, I know this because my mom loves to wear 100% cotton when she sleeps. So I feel like this is just a nice pajama pant. These are in great condition. Um, I could tell by the hem at the bottom. So yeah. And then I got this Maeve by Anthropology. So this is a newer um, style. And then it has like these really big sleeves. Just kind of a basic like shirt. I wish this was a medium because I would keep it, but it's a large um yeah this is really cute it's oversized i mean the fabric feels like it's like new you know maybe this was washed one time i would say if i had to guess okay another dress this one was by that bowden dress so definitely somebody had some good style this is chico's size us 10 and this is the newer chico's because it shows us 10. so they usually have like vanity sizing but they recently switched to putting the vanity size and like the regular size on their tags. You can see over here. 
So that's how I know that this is a newer piece. But this is just kind of like an oversized dress. There is some beading designs. Where is it? Oh, it's over here. So you can see there's that detail, which is nice. Hoping I can find a nice stock photo for this. I should be able to since it's a newer style. Okay, so this piece was kind of fun. I This was in a new rotation, and I don't know. I, I can't date this very well because there's no tags. But this is a vintage, I think, clown costume where it's like handmade. And I feel like... I feel like this is vintage just from the quality of it and just no seeing a lot of vintage clothing I can just kind of tell but there's no labels there's nothing I like threw this inside out this is the back so you untie this and you just jump in it's like a one size fits all because it's pretty oversized and big there is the stain in the front yeah so I feel like this would be kind of cool if I knew for sure if it was vintage or it had a tag. I'm assuming that it is, but you know, and there's like these kind of stains, like older stains. It just kind of has that wear that it's vintage. So I think I'm going to list it under the vintage category and kind of list it higher and see how it does and maybe lower it over time just to see, cause I don't know for sure what I have and that's kind of my strategy with these kind of things, but I think this is cool. I love it. I'm excited. Okay, next I have this Tommy Bahama 100% silk button up. And this is a size extra large. I mean, these do pretty well. It will take a second, but I feel like this one is in great condition. And yeah, I don't think I've sold this before, but we'll see. And then right next to that was this one. This one's giving more Chandler Bing vibes or like Kramer from Seinfeld, that kind of thing. Uh, so I'll use those as my keywords. But yeah, this is again, it's 100% silk. Okay, I was so excited when I found this. This is Lily Pulitzer. And it's just this cute ruffle cardigan with a tie. This is in excellent condition. Um, you can just tell by this like robe tie and everything, you know, everything looks really good. This is a size small medium. So yeah, it's kind of like a wrap robe cardigan. Really cute. Okay, more Athleta again, just like these olive green denim pants, size 12. These are again in excellent condition found with all those Athleta pants. Another Athleta size 10. These are 100% linen. I was really looking out with the Athleta and they're great condition. Okay, so these are the newer label Banana Republic. And again, these are like new. I could just tell that these have not been worn or washed. They still have that new crisp feeling. Um, so kind of a different like buttoned area. And then they have the a belt that goes with it so really cute nice for work career or just like you know if you want to dress up these are a great pant so because these are newer and they're in like new condition they're a newer style um and i think the size is pretty decent as well i picked those up Okay, this is really cute. So this is just a little velour tank. The brand was Sync Accept, which is great. It's a size medium. So not very substantial, um, but because of the brand, I decided to get this. It's definitely like a designer brand. Retails for a lot of money. Um, yeah, and it's just really nice, very well made, great condition. Okay, so these are Adriano Goldschmied, which is a great brand especially for like men's denim my my husband likes this brand these are a women's um these are a women's pant they're called the prima crop cigarette so kind of dated um yeah very audrey hepburn vibes on these um if they feel great i think they're my set well yeah they're size 30 i'm usually about a 29 so yeah, I mean, I don't think I'm gonna get a ton for these, but this is a really nice brand 
and these are very high quality pans so okay this was kind of a crazy find so this is a men's suit jacket so i saw this this was on a new rotation Saks Fifth Avenue, and then I went over to the other side and I saw Burberry. So pretty good. Um, I don't think the resale value on these is as crazy. Okay, so this is a bigger size too. It's a 46 long. It has the three buttons and it's 100% cotton. So it's not wool or anything like that. It's just cotton, which is fine. Um, it feels great. It's in great condition. Um, I'm going to try to list this for around 100 to 150 I'm thinking. Because, again, I don't think the resale value is that great for this. But it's still, you know, a really nice men's suit jacket. And then right next to that was this, which is kind of close to the same size. I never heard of this brand. It has, like, these elbow packet patches, which is super cute. Um, it's a men's, you know, he does, like, custom suits. So it's called Paul Frederick. Um, oh. Valet parking, Pittsburgh airport. He went to, I have his plane ticket. <laughs> Let's see, where did he go? Oh, I have his name. He went to Washington, D.C. Pittsburgh to Washington, D.C. There you go. Boarding group one. There you have it. Premier Access, United, he flew United, just in case you were wondering. Okay, anyways, so yeah, I mean, I'll have to take measurements of this. Does it have 100% cotton, 46 long? Okay, so, you know, I'll still take measurements because I know that this guy, when I Googled him, he did like custom suits, so maybe they altered some things, I'm not sure. Very well made, nice suit jacket. Okay, next I have Free People Beach size medium. These are just kind of like a wide knit leg pant. Nothing too crazy here. I'll probably list this for like 40 bucks. But you guys, I still, I love to pick up Free People. Okay, this one is kind of boring. Uh, Michael by Michael Kors size medium. I know that this will sell eventually. Kind of like a slinky dress. Really cute, definitely somebody will buy this for work or something. You know, this is just a brand that people trust, it's reliable, won't get a lot, but it's a Ben's pickup, so I'm, I'm okay with that. Okay guys, another Athleta item. These are the Summit Cargo Pant, size 10. And I know that this like, these lines on the end, like the Varsity line, I think that's what it's called, they're kind of like not in anymore, but I don't know. These are in great condition. You know, if I have to sit on them for a while, so be it. That's okay. They definitely are like a cargo style too, so like I can use that keyword. Okay, my friend found this item as well. I don't know if this was the best pickup. So this is Burberry, a Burberry purse. Um, but it's heavily flawed, very da uh, damaged. So it's really cute. It's like their bucket bag, but you can see in the front, there's a big stain there. And then also look at these holes, you know, they're all around. So these, this is just so flawed. Um, the buckles, like the hardware, this all looks great. You know, this leather looks good. This is, is, needing some help but um yeah there's this inside pouch that you can unbutton and so i don't know that's that's pretty nice right this is in great condition the inside like it looks to be okay they definitely were using this a lot hence the um the holes in the corners um i definitely think that this is authentic i can just tell by the feel of it I also looked online at other bags in this style because I found the style bag and it looked the exact same. So, so I was going to list this on the, the cheaper side, obviously, just because there's, there's so many flaws with it. Um, and if somebody wants to restore it or take the hardware or I don't know, you know, somebody might really want this bag and be okay with the holes and all that stuff. So, um, yeah, I'm going to list that for pretty cheap and see how it goes. Okay, next I got this 
pajama silk, 100% silk sleep shirt. And the brand is called Silky Silk. Never heard of it. I just felt it and I knew it was silk. I know people like to sleep in silk. Didn't look it up. Um, or it's called Silk Silky. Sorry, I said Silky Silk. It's Silk Silky. Super cute. Um, this was next to the Ralph Lauren collection blazer. So I was like, I'll just get it. Okay, this was also next to the Ralph Lauren. So this is Theory, size 10. And this is a long maxi dress. Super cute. I know Theory, the resale market is questionable sometimes, but I felt like this was pretty substantial. Very nicely made. It's very lagging look. Um, I'm guessing this is 100% cotton. Yeah, th this is in great condition. I mean, the fabric just feels so crisp. Uh, yeah, 100% cotton, so. I feel like that'll do pretty well. Okay, next I have this L.L. Bean shacket, and the inside is so nice. It has, like, this flannel uh, double layer, and it's just this corduroy, like, chore jacket or barn jacket. Um... The size is an extra large, regular, 100% cotton. So I feel like this brand is very reputable and I like it personally. I just, I think this brand is good. So I tend to want to pick it up more. Um, but yeah, I think this is really cute. Dark brown corduroy jacket. Okay, I got this for me. This is so stinking cute. Oh my goodness, I'm gonna button it up. I already tried it on and it fits me so well. Look at how cute this dress is. This is vintage and it's a size eight and it fits me like a glove. The bottom is so cute, it all goes out like that. It's just like a midi length. It is so stinky cute, I really like the fabric. It is pretty decently made. So yeah, I just, I love that. I think it's so adorable. Next I got these Clark's booties. Okay, these are in good condition. Um, there's still like a sticker on the bottom and everything. They just feel great. These are a size eight, I think. And they're just, it says Clark's Collection, US seven. So I just thought these were great for the season. Classic staple piece. So really cute. Oh, there is some scuffing right there. Actually, I'm just seeing. Okay, a few more items. I got this logo lounge. So this is logo by Lori Goldstein. And this kind of stuff is sold on QVC. People really like it. This is a size 2X. So I got it for the brand. The condition is great. It's more of a substantial piece. The size is good. And I didn't pay a whole lot for it. So for all of those reasons, I picked this item up. Okay, this was a great piece by that other Chico's dress and then the Bowden dress. This is again, the newer label Chico's. 100% linen embroidered maxi dress. So stinking cute. I love this kind of stuff, guys. Very substantial, well-made. This is in a great condition, size 10. I mean, this is the kind of stuff that I wanna sell all the time. This is amazing. Okay, these are Banana Republic. Excellent condition. They're kind of like these satin silky. I don't know if they're loungewear, like you dress them up or I guess you could dress them down. I tried them on, I saw the stock photo, which looks super cute. Um, she had it more dressed up. So I kind of thought that these were lounge, but she had it more dressed up. So I tried them on and I was like, oh, maybe I could pull these off, but they just kind of look like, you know, pajama pants or something. So I don't know. I feel like you have to style them pretty well. Maybe I wasn't styling them, styling them the best. Okay, next I got Beta Brand, which I know they're not doing as well as they used to, but this, these were just in excellent condition. Um, work pants, size large, short, petite. So I just threw those in my cart, we'll see. Two more items, guys. Okay, another Banana Republic. This is, again, the newer label. It says Banana Republic Premium Denim. Again, excellent condition. These are high-rise crop boot, 30 short. So I figured those would be an easy list. And last but not least, 
I got these Anthropology sleep pants. They say Anthropology featuring Michelle Morin. And they are these adorable, very like novelty print. Uh, that's a good keyword for these, novelty. Also storybook, story, animals, wildlife. I can name some of the animals I'm seeing like zebra, birds, tiger. I mean, there's just so many keywords for this and it's a good brand. So I just, I knew that this was a good pickup. Okay, so that was everything from this Goodwill Bins haul. I am super excited. I definitely found a few like little designer items sprinkled throughout, so that was pretty cool. But yeah, my favorite definitely was that Ralph Lauren collection military jacket. That was such a cool find. I always wanted to find a Ralph Lauren military jacket. I'm so excited that I found it. I'm gonna put that on probably like my top 10 favorite finds ever. So that was so cool. Um, let me know what you guys think. And let me know what you guys thought about that clown costume. If you think that that was vintage or homemade or recent, I don't know. Let me know what you think. But yeah, I hope you guys had a good time watching. And if you're not yet subscribed, please hit subscribe. Also like this video, comment down below, do all of the things. Um, but yeah, I'll catch you guys on the next one. Thank you for watching. Bye.